<laughs> right, uh, good afternoon. It's David Berry Green, DBG Italia. It's Tuesday, the 9th of October, si mi sembra, 2018. I've come to Santa Maria della Mora to find the great Fili Luigi Odero Cantina uh, and to catch up with the guys, to see how they're, they're looking. Hello. Fresh. <laughs> still alive. <laughs> and uh, still alive. Uh, but it's not an anata. Diciamo uh, difficile, non difficile, challenging, si dice, sfidante, no? Yes, uh, yes, because we have uh, 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 a lot of rain here in the springtime. Okay. And uh, uh, a little bit of problem with the disease, etc. But okay. uh, at the end, uh, we obtain, I think, uh, good results. For, okay. Uh, good grades. Uh, we open, uh, don't rain more. <laughs> right. Uh, but the results we pick now, the most important vineyards that we have in the property, right. Vigna Rionda, the, the most important part of Rocca Rivera, and Specola too. Two. Okay. And uh, yesterday and today we pick Broglio for the regular Barolo. Brollo is in, uh, in, in Cerro Lunga. Okay. And uh, we pick another vet uh, uh, to produce another vet of uh, Santa Mar from Santa Maria to okay. produce the Barolo, class, classic Barolo. Okay. At this point we are... Uh, we are in a, a good, uh, good way. A good position, isn't yes. it? You're seeing the end is, in, end, end is in sight. And compared to 2017, what was 2018? Uh, I, I see uh, in, the first time of, uh, in the first time of maceration uh, a little bit more, uh, a better phenolic ripeness in Nebbiolo grapes. And okay. this is good. Because the harvest uh, time is a bit, tannins, bit later, no? Yes, a little bit late. Uh, we have uh, the, the last two weeks very cold during the night. So, sure. And then uh, for this, uh, very, 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 very good uh, ripeness in the skin. Okay. Uh, and also good uh, ripeness uh, of the tannins in the, the seeds. seeds. Yeah. And uh, the Nebbiolo looks good. And there's, there's a quantity and in, uh, in quality. Can you, quantity and quality, yes. Classic. Quantity a little bit more compared to the sure. 2017, but quality higher si, for sure. me. Uh, and uh, let's ask Matt, <laughs> Matt Light. Matt's uh, coming from uh, Victoria, is that right, Matt? Yeah, from Melbourne, Australia. Matt Melbourne, for so the harvest, second, second year, he came in last year. Came here last year and caught the, bit the bug or something, caught, caught the, the bug. And they've been it's nice come, enough to ask me back. Come back. It's What's been really good. I mean, as Francesco said, it was probably a difficult start to the growing season, but the team did some really good work in the vineyards. I came over here, I was blown away with the, the health and the quality of the grapes. And uh -huh. since I arrived probably about five, six weeks ago now, the weather's just been superb. And right. we had cooler nights when they all and we're sort of been sitting, crossing our fingers that the weather was going to hold and it has. And the fruit we've got in this year is really, really good. Uh -huh. And there's a bit of it, so we're pretty busy at the moment. But it's, it's so fun. what are you, what, what are you, um, what are you receiving? I mean, you just received Broly, is that right? Is that right? Yes. And, uh, and Matt, you, you've been uh, you, uh, fermenting what are we, cement at the moment, or what's the...? We've got all the, the vinification over here. Okay. So basically the way they've got it set up here is they've got a vat dedicated to each of the vineyards. So okay. A, a vat for, for okay. Vinerionda, a vat for Rocca Rivera, and they're all sort of ticking along now and really starting to have you, the and perfume you, and the tannin. Have you tasted, I was going to say, have you tasted the fruit as, it, as it's come in? Yep. Right? Yes, yep. every day. What, <laughs> every day, every Matt, time. Matt, what's, what's the difference, for, what's the difference, would you say, for, for Vigna Rionda and uh, Rocca di Rivera? <laughs> <laughs> from an outside, from uh, not knowing that side of it. <laughs> no, no, this year, the, the thing that's just singing in, in Vigna Rionda is the aromatics. Even at, at the berry stage, yes. the Vigna Rionda was incredibly floral. Really delicate, really fine tannins, beautiful acidity. The tannins in the Rock and Rivera are probably a little bit more robust and probably looking at some more mature dark yes. fruit character. Okay. Um, but each of them have their own elegance. It's okay. quite good to see them side by side. Any other vineyards you, you thrilled? Uh, Specula looks very good. good this year. Specula this year very good. Specula is uh, uh, Rive, 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 Rive Santa, Santa Maria. Maria. Okay. Yes. Very, very interesting. Very good. Uh, uh, Why do you think technical Why? ripeness, but okay. also phenolic? Then, in general, it's not easy in this place, then it's not so high in altitude to arrive to the complete phenolic ripeness. Okay, this year, this with, year. The, with the cold night in the okay. last two weeks, we arrive at the very, very good results. I think. Okay, yeah. good. And just one, one final question, Matt. You am I right in thinking you, you planted some Nebbiolo in Victoria? I bought <laughs> some grapes and made a Nebbiolo. Oh, you made yeah. a Nebbiolo. I haven't planted it yet, but right. maybe that's another horizon, yeah. Uh, Botte Grande or...? Well, <laughs> 500 litre puncheon, which 
Francesco thinks is way too small, but that's as big as that's I've got. A, that's, so. a, that's as far as it goes. So, uh, um, but no, I what stage is it? What stage is your Nebbiolo? Like tasting preview, eh? Francesco oh, has had a taste. Is there a consultancy going on here? No maybe? consultancy, but <laughs> I, I was waiting to get the tick of approval or to yes. hang my head in shame, but he said it was okay. It was so. okay. So you brought a sample over from Australia? I brought a barrel sample over. A bar <laughs> not a barrel, but a barrel sample. No, no, that's but it was actually a really good experience. And I was actually... I must say, quite impressed with the, the tannins, how they looked over here. I thought it would look a bit flabby, but uh -huh. it actually looked really good. So Very good, yes. It was a proud moment. Good. Excellent. All right, guys. Well, thank you. Grazie tantissime. E buona continuazione. Thank you. Grazie. Ciao, ciao. Grazie. Ciao, ciao. 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 ciao.